I'm Samantha Deitcher for Investment Pitch Media. Noram Ventures, along with its joint venture partner Alba Minerals, turned to a couple of experts in mineral leaching to determine if it is practical and economical to apply current leaching technologies to lithium clays found in Nevada's Clayton Valley. Membrane development specialists, with a reputation for developing applications for membrane technology dating back to 1980, and OTEC Innovative Extraction Solutions, a subsidiary of Barrick Gold, reported 96.25% lithium recovery following a two-step leach process in a successful bench test on the company's Clayton Valley clays. Back in the 1970s, the former Bureau of Mines indicated that acid digestion of Clayton Valley's lithium clays was technically feasible, but not cost-effective due to the water and acid losses using conventional leaching processes. However, following a bench test commissioned by NORAM in the May and June of 2017, membrane development specialists concluded, the mining of lithium clays, we believe, is now economically feasible using MDS acid membranes and systems to purify and concentrate lithium and simultaneously recover water and acid for reuse in the extraction process. Given the volumes of water and acid needed for the processing of lithium clay, being able to recover both for reuse in the process is a huge benefit which makes the digestion of lithium cost-effective and attractive. Due to the extremely inexpensive cost of power in the Clayton Valley, 4 cents per kilowatt, and with power amounting to approximately 50% of the operating cost for membrane plants used in this process, this process translates into a low operating cost per ton of lithium carbonate. Mark Ayrton, NORAM's president, stated, our focus is not only on finding and developing lithium and graphite deposits, but also on sourcing and supporting new, environmentally friendly processing techniques to produce our lithium and graphite products. The company's properties, which cover approximately 13,000 acres, are located within one mile of Albemarle Corporation's lithium brine operations. Albemarle, the only lithium producer in the United States, has been producing lithium from deep wells from the basin beneath the Clayton Valley continuously since 1967. Just south of Albemarle's Silver Peak operation and to the west of Noram Spartan Group claims lies Pure Energy with an NI43101 inferred resource of 218,000 metric tons of lithium carbonate equivalent. And to the north is Tesla's Gigafactory. Tesla, with a planned production rate of 500,000 cars per year in the latter half of this decade, is expected to alone use today's entire worldwide production of lithium-ion batteries. NORAM's drilling of 46 shallow core holes into the lithium-rich sediments previously identified through surface sampling has provided a basis for the definition of an inferred lithium resource. The lithium assays from the drilling provided results that were quite consistent over a reasonably large area of closely spaced drill holes. The deposit remains open in all directions and at depth, with the drill testing less than 1% of the extensive area. The report identified an inferred mineral resource of approximately 17 million metric tons at a grade of about 1,060 parts per million lithium, which equates to 96,476 metric tons of lithium carbonate equivalent. The report recommends a second phase of shallow core drilling at an estimated cost of $90,000 in U.S. currency and a concurrent pilot scale test by membrane development specialists to further demonstrate the extractability of lithium from the clays with a budget estimated at $480,000. The shares are trading at $0.07.5 cents, and with 175 million shares outstanding, the company is capitalized at $13.1 million. For more information, please visit the company's website, noramventures.com, or contact Mark Ireton, President, at 604-761-9994, or email mark at noramventures.com. I'm Samantha Deitcher for Investment Pitch Media.